Hello and welcome, my name is David from the technical team at DMS. In today's video, we'll be bringing you information related to the AVQM range of control valves as manufactured by Danfoss. Should you have any questions at all, please feel free to get in touch with us as per the contact details provided, or always leave a comment in the box below. Uh, the AVQM valves are flow limiting valves. They're designed to be used on heating systems in order to improve the efficiency of the flow itself. What they do is their internal diaphragm will open and close in order to restrict and allow flow to pass. Uh, and this will just mean that flow will never exceed a certain point as per the flow limits set on the valve itself. What this can do is obviously uh, prevent any pumps from running into an overflow situation and also can help reduce the size of pumps by limiting the flows that will actually occur on a system. And by limiting the flows, temperature is also maintained at a constant rate into the actual room or building it's controlling onto. So this will improve the efficiency of the system, which is good for installers, and also improve the efficiency of the heating system as a whole, which is good for consumers. Ultimately, installation costs and heating costs will both be reduced as the system works in a more efficient manner. The AVQM valves are available from 10 millimeters up to 250 mil in their connection sizes. The smaller 10 mil valves are up to 50 mil valves are all a screwed union connection as standard. Uh, from 65 mil up to 250 mil, the valves are all supplied with a flanged PN16 connection. All of the ABQMs have a preset flow range that they actually work to as a minimum and a maximum. Therefore, you have to always check your flow range, not just the line size when sizing up your corresponding ABQM valve. By adding an actuator to the ABQMs, it now becomes a pressure independent control valve or PICV. Uh, the actuator gives the valve full authority in its control and basically you can get a simple on off actuator, a 0 to 10 volt setting range, a 0 to 20 milliamp setting range and also a float floating point control actuator. Um, all four have different, different variants that are available across the range of ABQMs to suit all the different sizes and different manners of actuator heads. Uh, and basically they give the valve more control over the pressure involved and also the heating and they can be used as PICVs for installations such as air handling units, fan coil units as, as raw examples and again with full authority. Thank you very much for watching, uh, that's all from me today. Uh, should you have any questions get in touch with us in the office or in the comment box below uh, and as ever please like give the video a like if you found it interesting, uh, give it a share so others may find it as well and please stay subscribed for future content from DMS. Thank you very much for watching, I'll see you next time.